All right. This next song is one we do not do terribly often. And maybe we're about been banned, but we're in a different country now. That's right. <laughs> the laws don't apply to us here. Uh, it does involve... No, not that. <laughs> More licorice penises. <laughs> of course it involves licorice penises. That's a given. Does Which involve... is our Gary Glitter cover band. Hey. <laughs> oh, you lost them. See what you did there? It was your reaction. <laughs> does involve this. <laughs> Intrigued, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, you, you, you? Some of you think that I'm, I'm selling the song this way. This is, this is a deterrent and a punishment. <laughs> As any of you who've ever been to Ireland well know. Uh, this song also requires a bit of explanation. Please uh, raise your hand if you do not know what I mean when I use the phrase, urinal cake. If you do not know what I'm talking about, please turn to the gentleman sitting nearest <laughs> you during the first verse and a half of this song. He'll explain it. This is called The Ballad of Eddie Prager. I also may not remember all the words, so I have a cheat sheet here. <laughs> But, I'm going to do my best to not use it. If at some point I must stop and go to the cheat sheet, I want you to punish me with a full round of boo. <laughs> but only if I go to the cheat sheet. This part doesn't count. I'm just <laughs> By the way, you may feel free to sway. No, don't do it, I'm getting motion sick. <laughs> Alright, let's see how this goes. There on the bar stool sat old Eddie Prager, filled with three schlitzes, three shots of rye. Joe the bartender poured two shots of Jaeger. Old Eddie downed them with a bilch and a sigh. The bartender thought that he heard Eddie mumble about brain in the lizard, and he asked for one more. He pushed back his stool and resigned. They stumbled to the room with the stick figure man on the door. At a faded pink discus, a urinal cake near the end of its days. Tired and misshapen, smelling slightly of citrus, a lifetime of battles had it worn near away. Eddie regarded his sweet smelling rival and began to attend to the business at hand. The condom dispenser and the 60 watt light bulb. For silent witness to the cake's final stand. Eroding, eroding, eroding away. Oh, the cake she was bound to go under that day. Eroding, eroding, eroding away. And with one final flush, she was gone. <laughs> Drunkenly struggling to undo his fly, this cake stood prepared for her suicide mission to stand through the deluge of the oncoming tide. The urinal cake stared at old Eddie Framer, or maybe it would have if it had had eyes. Eddie unloaded his Schlitz Ryan Jaeger. The cake sat there slowly reducing in size. Rock! <laughs> he 
He paused for a moment, overcome with a shiver. A deep forest silence pervaded the room. He thought about waterfalls, fountains, and rivers, and soon enough, Eddie's bombardment resumed. The outcome, of course, was a foregone conclusion. Valor and bravery wasted in vain. She broke into pieces in the swirling profusion, the push of a lever, and she spun down the drain. Eroding, eroding, eroding away, oh, the cake she was bound to go under that day. Eroding, eroding, eroding away, and with one final touch, she was gone. Old Eddie Prager returned to his bender, never to think of the conflict again. And long after closing time, Joe the bartender placed a new cake where the old one had been. Eroding, eroding, eroding away, oh, the cake she was bound to go under that day. Eroding. She was gone. <laughs> That's right, we just spent four and a half minutes singing about pee. <laughs> like you do. Which <laughs> Which is my R. Kelly cover band. <laughs> oh wow, a small percentage got that one. You're gonna have to go to Wikipedia after this show. Of R. Kelly, you'll laugh a lot. <laughs>